Hi everyone, my name is Richard with the Virtua Gym Client Success Team, and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about challenges and the difference between a public challenge and a private challenge. So when we go from our community page, which is the landing page of our portal, you can see that we have a number of different tabs up top that can bring you to the different community sections, and one of them is going to be challenges. So we're going to navigate to there right away, and then what you're going to go ahead and see is what we're going to get to. Uh, you'll see a list of all of the public challenges that are in the system, along with my club challenges. So what you'll notice right off the bat is that we have a couple of challenges that will have Virtua Gym, and those have been created by the developers here um, when the system was uh, created. We also have challenges that administrators have created, like this one that's just kind of reoccurring and always there, with 9,000 people in it. And then you'll see that you have some club challenges, and that's because I've gone in and created a challenge specifically as a club challenge where only members of my club can join in. Now, both of these challenges can be available to your clients depending on how you set your settings from the business settings options. So if you go into your business settings and you go to the portal content tab, you'll see a number of different uh, options on how you can specify what content is visible to all of your members. And one of the things you'll see is challenges can be visible to clients and what type of challenges. So if you say only club challenges visible or all challenges visible, that is where your clients are either going to see all of these or just the club challenges that you've created. And what you'll notice is when you go to a club challenge, what you can do is you can join the challenge yourself, which you'll see I'm already part of. You can also invite different clients of yours to be part of it. It'll send them an email and a notification that says they can join the challenge. Or you can just add them in. Again, if you're the coach, you can just add them into the challenge that you want them to be part of. Uh, what you'll notice with the public challenges is that these buttons are still there, but right now the functionality of them uh, is limited so that you won't actually be able to invite them or add them in to the public challenge, but you can still always send them the link to the challenge where they can join in themselves. And then just when you are going in and create a challenge, it's pretty straightforward. You can go and create a public one by adding a new challenge or adding a club challenge, clicking new club challenge. And when you get to this screen, you'll see you follow the steps to create your challenge. If you do have any questions about this, we do have some really good help desk articles up here in the help. You can always go through the academy as well, how to create a challenge. If you do have any other questions, you can always email support by emailing us at support at Thanks.